Alameda Clamato. Ah. Uh, so. Oh, hi, Dagger. How's Come. everyone been enjoying the stream so far? Because uh, we're, we're about to enter the, the longest chapter of the comic. Yeah, we are two chapters in. I guess kind of including the small chapter zero, three chapters. And we are almost four hours into the stream. Howdy, Crimson. Welcome, welcome. No, this chapter cover has always been this way. <laughs> yeah, it's always been this way. <laughs> I, I thank you, though. <laughs> Here, I'm, I'll give you guys a nice up close view. Yeah. The... Ah, I can't explain that. Never mind. I was about to explain something that was spoilers. Sorry. Don't. Yeah, that, that's the only thing that Scott has to work through with crossing her brain is uh, and normally when it's the two of us in a voice call, all locks are unlocked and Scott can say whatever she wants. Yeah. She has to hold back. Right I now. have to hold back. I want to talk about things, but I can't. It's easy to forget. Yeah. Alright, let me open up the first few pages of chapter 3, and we can get started. <sighs> I've been eating Triscuits, uh, dill pickle flavored. They're really good. Alright, we can go to the first one. Wait, wait. <gasps> Thank you for the follow, LJ8207. Did I say 207? 2007. Ah! <laughs> Wait, it's supposed to be 82,007. <sighs> like, it was a show that what I know from someone who only read it once. No, that is A-OK. -okay. Yeah, it's totally fine. Photographic memory is not what we expect of people. That's partly why we're making this easier to read. Exactly. What the... Who are you? What are you? I... Why won't she? So, is this how little you care? Am I going to have to kill her to make you come here? Don't you want to save her? Do you really want to relive this agony? Poosh. Poosh! Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Rubeline? Stand back. You have no power. I will hold this one back. Yeah, um... It, it flo there used to be floaty text here, like the oops, you know, and there are some edits here that I can't explain either. No, oh, there's one edit that we can't explain. Oh yeah. As Ronald used to go, "Are you the wish?" Is that was so stupid? <laughs> it should just be, "What are you?" Like yeah, exactly. Okay. We can go to the next page. This one has a massive edit! <laughs> that again is like, why did you make this edit? I'm like, I did Oh yeah, this was a page where Scott started to go off the wall with art edits and I had to like but, no, no, constantly but, hold her back. But, but this this art edit was important though. Because it, mm -hmm. because, uh, because it, remember, he, this character used to do something different. Now it doesn't do that. Run off Esmeralda, Golden Gate Asia. No. <laughs> And there's just, you know. Oh, I can't wait for people to see this. I have no time for you, Star Chaser. Look at that. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> uh, the reason why... Yes, I know that Rubenai looks like an Among Us. The reason for this edit, for giving... Uh... This, uh, the purple guy character, I'm not going to say their name in case there's new viewers. The purple guy character, Electric Sparks this way. It was because people thought that, oh, he just got pushed like nothing. Like, he just got swatted away like a fly and it was like, it wasn't that big of a deal. There was not much power behind the character that smacked him. That couldn't be further from the truth. A lot of you know who have read the comic that 
this particular character is really strong, too. Rubeline is also meant to be very strong, but I, it's not quite showcased, unfortunately. He doesn't get the chance. So, imagine getting hit by, like, a piece of paper and going, Oh! I, I don't know if I'm explaining myself correctly. Like Android what, 16. What Scott damage. is trying to say is uh, she put more impact into the hit. Yeah. <laughs> the, the hit had to have more impact because they're not a weak character. They're a strong character. All right, next page. Hmm. Remember, Stella relied on Rubeline to go and take care of things. You can go to the next page. Uh, also, Emblem... Yeah. It actually has the faction on it now. All of them do. We're just showcasing it again. Soup, soups, wrong buttons. Azur, where are you? Ooh, is the crop still good? I accidentally resized the window. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, it's good. Azur, where are you? Azur, who, who's there? Who is there? I was I was preloading a cracker in my mouth and I realized Scott, I have to read next. Yeah, you know what to do. Please tell me you know. Oh, what to do. I know what to do. Yeah, hold on. Uh. In the past, uh, Rubeline and Azure did not have the symbols, uh, the correct factions at all. I, I'm, I guess I'm going to explain the reason why, because it's a really stupid reason. It was because... You're going to laugh. Stella was like, no, you can't show your ranks. You can't scare her with your ranks. You have to go like you were normal ranked. No ranked. Yeah. That was no. such a stupid <laughs> reason, and I hate myself forever for doing that one. God damn. Because in chapter 4, originally when I drew the pages, Rubeline had his Gladius mark. Azure had his Virgula mark. They were there. They were present. Yep. Alright. We can do the next Scary page. rings. <laughs> next page? Mm-hmm. I'm still really happy with this. these two scenes coming up. Look at you, Emmy. Still the shining star I remember. You also read the next page. <laughs> I will, yes. Take care, Neon. Thank you for oh, watching. Oh, take care, Neon. Have fun. Have fun, yay. Preload the next pages, too. We can go to the next one. Yeah. Mom. I... This is I I have shush. Me too, Emmy. Mwah. Wait, are you not completely skinned alive? Of course. I actually tried to rebuild it. I'd use more stardust, but it's complicated. What name were you given? I was named Esmeralda. Ugh, figures. Come with me. I'm so happy I got to see you once again. I'll keep you safe. So, Mom, did you also get a new name? Doratus, but I despise this name. So, there's an edit here. Yeah. And I like this edit, actually. It was never in... Okay. The hearts floating there was just meant to be like a cool background effect. But, Gunny pointed out that, oh, I thought that she just manifested the hearts. I'm like, you know what? Yeah. That's way better, actually. And it showcases what you can do better.
Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Squeaky. Especially when she gives her explanations later, this makes sense that she can do this. The rain is sandstorm. No! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, trick. I got... I, I have to imagine that... Uh, you can go on the next one, by the way. I have to imagine that Kate and Trick, like, in person, must be a riot. <laughs> like, my god. A short walk later. <clears throat> I remember this place. We used to come here all the time, but why are we here? I want to teach you about the universe. You don't have much time though. I can't help him, the purple one heat, he'll kill me. Wait, we are already dead, are we not? Of course, Semi, but I'm talking about spiritual death, obliteration. Speaking of death, remember what Azura did to your corpse? Now try to focus, dear. He did it for you. Given the circumstances, I don't blame him, but you need to experience this. The essence of a wish. Very important is that I was trying to communicate something, and I when I told Gunny, Gunny was like, Miracle's not communicating that here at all. Or rather, it's communicated very poorly. Yeah, that, that's like the general gist of a lot of the edits we did. And so this page has a lot of edits to address things. Oh my god, Trick. Trick yeah, saying, is saying this feels clear and concise. Yeah. Trick saying, we're such a riot, the police toss tear gas through our front windows regularly. Oh no. God damn. I like this page. I really like this page too. And out of context panel, if you want to zoom in onto panel 5. Remember what Azure did to your corpse? <laughs> <laughs> I never got the connection between Azure did this and Miracle wants her to do it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That was, that was another clear up that we're doing here. I got it. My blankie is not working. Heat blanket? My, my blankie. My little blankie. I have a rat blanket. What aspect are you considered? Are you uh, confused about? Yeah, we're curious. To be fair, if you're speaking as a previous reader and you're still confused about something, we're, we are about to get to that. The, the next few pages cover. Oh, that. what Asia did to the corpse? Uh, remember when Asia went with his hand and did a little gesture and a. Essence of the a essence wish of appeared. Wish. Yeah, yeah. That, that's exactly it. Yeah. This whole time I've been drawing the monthly character from last month, by the way. I've been drawing Ainsley. <laughs> like, now and then, like, I, I can only throw a few lines and then more work to do. Oh, oops. <clears throat> You're gonna go yeah, to the next page, the, by the way. The body more presentable. Exactly, yeah. She doesn't want to completely traumatize us. <laughs> Did you read the last page? Or did I? You did. It's my turn. Okay. Let me just uh make a Don't eat a, eat a cracker. No, I'm not eating a cracker. I'm publishing pages Don't in eat the future. A pickle. I will eat a pickle though. Something bothers me. Some of these wishes seem really useless. Are we supposed to grant the important wishes? <laughs> Evidently, my dear Emmy. But there are no useless wishes. The only wishes we have to be careful about are those created with cruel intent in mind. Now, useless wishes are easy, but a deep wish, that's a whole different story. Miami. It's very hard to grant. Miami. I know. I, 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 Miami. Miami. I'm sorry. Miami. It's very hard to grant. But then, how do we grant them? We can't touch mortals or talk to them either. Either, rather. How is it possible? And here's Anthrax. Elsewhere. 
the way to grant a wish is not by direct contact. Oh, so that's it. I think we use our superpowers or something like that. Ugh, superpowers. Well, in a way we do. I wish I could fix things between the both of us. It is possible. You would just have to give up certain things. Escaping will only hurt you. You'd face any discussion of him meant being with what you can only describe as a fallen angel, correct? See, Weaver? They are the ones that must grant their own wishes. Only inspiration required, no fighting. Eggs over my Emmy. <laughs> no, I spit on my blankie. Stop spitting. I'm trying not to spit. I can go to the next page. Shoot, shoot, two. Mm. Back to blow. <laughs> June 20-something. And off he goes. Huh? Is that simple? Of course. Such a satisfying feeling it is. And this also completes your trial, pupil. Well done. Hold on, hold on. Doesn't this mean we have no free will? Of course we do. Don't be ridiculous. Will is alive and all. Why do you ask? Well, what if another wish prevented this one coming true somehow? We determine which one is important for the universe. Well, that <laughs> sucks. It's sad but true. That's what they'll say, because we can't get to all wishes. They become worse than the dark matter when they start favoring stars, leaving the wishes that do need our help far behind to die. However, there are ways that you can grant two wishes at once. Your death inspired multiple wishes, Emmy. Not one, not two, but three wishes. Can you sense them? Oh my god, Chris, Hotline Miami. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. Miami Vice! <laughs> I missed it elsewhere the first time around and now it makes so much more sense. That That's fair. Three wishes, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. It is three wishes, like a genie. <laughs> Which, by the way, we've never. Uh, 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 oh my god, Gutty! Imagine genies in Star Wars. What do we do? Oh, <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> we have discussions like these sometimes, where it's like, "What if this?" And we're like, "Ugh." Genies do not exist. Uh, you can do the next one. Oh, no, I do the next one. To knock me off this far with such ease. Wait, this is not. <gasps> Zach, hello. Hello. Thank you Thank for you the prime. Th Thank you for the thirty decades of subscriptions. <laughs> also, I hope you're doing well, Zach. Yay! I like the lily boat. To knock me off this far with e such ease, he left, or maybe hiding. Either way, we can't do this alone. Beam! I want to point out, you added the word off to the first bubble two to three times. To knock me this far with such ease. Okay. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> I woke up, your stream gave me a crunchy 144p Burger King hat. <laughs> ah, the, mm. the, the angry whopper. Holy side mouth, Batman. I know, right? Ready when you are. Go ahead. Oh, God. Yes, those are clouds. <laughs> those are really nice clouds. <laughs> I, yeah, next one. <sighs> well, what is that? Weaver, we have to move. <laughs> God, Anthrax's ear holes were so tiny. Old Anthrax art. Yeah. Gods, this whole place will be swarming with warriors. Emmy, listen to me closely. The dark matter will see that signal and come too. The hunter's wish is not the trial one. But if you grant it, you can help the trial wish come true. For example, let's just say this is a star. 
two different wishes from different mortals, seemingly detached. They can have things in common, things that bond them. Many are blind to this. They don't see the connections. Uh, more clarification as to what we intended to say here, especially. Yeah, just being more direct. Mm -hmm. Star Wars don't have Earth as we know it, so how do we know that it's a cosmonaut rather than an astronaut? Oh, easy. Uh, Adria has a gun. <laughs> Sorry, no, not Adria. Ruboli has a gun. Yeah, I was about to say, what do you mean the farm boy has a gun? Well, then I guess they normally would, but Azura does not. It, can you quickly go to, like, page two of chapter three? Page two? Yeah, sure. Oh, I don't show it well, actually. Uh, never you mind. don't show it at all. Oh, actually, it's... Oh, uh, no, it's very hidden. He has a gun, trust me. There it is. It's more clear on my recent pin design that I made, actually. Yeah. Don't worry, I kind of want him to use the gun one day. You ready for next page? Mm, yes. This one was a big thank you, Gunny, for helping me clarify what I want and intend to say. Page. Oh, yeah. And for... Uh... Legacy readers, y'all are going to enjoy this page. Yeah, um, remember when she explained the dark matter here or tried to? Well, you'll see. We're going to get to it. Yep. And here is the third wish. It threatened the constellation. This wish is a cruel one. Yes, I, uh, handled it for you. It's a revenge wish. Such wishes represent the darker side of ourselves. We all have darkness inside us. Dark matter creatures can be born from cruel wishes. So that is where they came from. That is true for some, but not all. None fully understand the dark matter, even myself, with all that I have seen. They are living darkness, preying on others and spreading their corruption. Unlike some with the element of darkness, dark matter means to destroy all. That includes us, Emmy. Don't fall to corruption. I can't lose you. Not again. Now, Emmy, focus. Can you hear the wishes whispering? Let the cosmic flow guide you. I wish to... I wish to... I wish to... I wish to do you know who these wishes belong to? Now we're getting to the essence of the wish thing. Mm -hmm. uh, also, let's see how all the wishes have their own different fonts too. I was thought not not fonts, different it's handwriting. Like yeah, handwriting to show more personality, which was very important. Also, to identify the wishes to show that's actually individual people wishing. Before it was just the Stella Major font for every single one, and that was that, that really confused people. Yeah. I'm glad it's better now. You do the next one. And then lower the meats again. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I wish to impress my friends at the tavern. Hunter's wish, no doubt. I wish I could see my child. This one is clearly my father's. But wait, what about this wish? I wish to make that human pay. And this wish is, I wish I could see my child, Uncle Corvus. Well done, my love. I knew you could do it. Your soul and the cosmos are united as one. I now know for sure. My work is complete. Across the cosmos and beyond the stars, may the sun guide me, oh so far. Cosmic forces, heed my plea. May solar winds set us free. Boom boom. I don't think there's much to talk about here. Uh -uh. It's pretty much the same. Oh, and don't forget, chat. If you have questions, feel free to ask. Yes, ask us questions. Say how we're doing a bad job. Spam with green screen. <laughs> All good. You hear the people sing, singing the song of wish desires. It is the music of the people who will not be lost again. Why is Gunny's nose blue? Because it's just my character's design. It's blue flesh, <laughs> blue blood. Blue blood, like royalty? Mmm. Oh, I never thought oh. of it that way. <laughs> <laughs> this page. Would Izzy would, eat yes, bath Izzy, pizza? Izzy would absolutely eat bath pizza. She would, yes. She would because it's food. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, actually, I need to put- I need to put my blankie on my chair. Then I need to sit on the chair, then pull the blankie up like a burrito. Dude. Don't you dare draw me the canine nose, you of all people. I just hit myself with my hairband. <laughs> You're a burrito now, god damn it. <laughs> Blueberry blood. Mm. Okay. Mom, what's happening? Sorry, I must go. I cannot stay in one spot for too long, thankfully. I taught you all you need, I think. Are you going far? Can I see you again? It's light years, um, very far away. I do not want you to go. The Buizels will miss you, Mom. <laughs> I don't want you to go. Mom, seeing you again is like a miracle. Me? A miracle? Emmy, my dear, your heart is so... is so beautiful. I, I said that incorrectly, actually. But I died. I don't have a heart anymore. That doesn't matter. You may be dead, but the heart within your soul, it can still be as strong as a living one. Our past, our memories, you can still hold your heart. <laughs> That's a miracle. Uh, it's a really big challenge for to use the point to uh, redeem, I guess. Yeah. I need to go, my people need me. Yes, actually. Miracle's actually Wait. pulling up a Pucci. I must go. Whatever's... My people need me. Yeah. Then she goes to reenact Disaster Girl. No, that's not canon, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, next. Oh, it's an Izzy. Hi, Izzy. You better look after her. I do not take requests, but I will do my best to defend her. Hopefully, Izzy will be more amicable now that she is free from control. Emmy, about your heart. Follow it. Your path and no one else's. <laughs> <laughs> you can do the next one. Oh yeah, she is. Yep, right there. Don't worry, it's just a burrito. Mom, Doradus. No, not Doradus. I prefer names with purpose. A name with meaning to me. You called me a miracle. I love that name. Bye, miracle. Uh, we also have the... <laughs> Not that. We have the miracle... Um, well, that was there before. Yep. I hit the wrong button. No, no, but... <laughs> yeah, we, we have the miracle text uh, dissipating in the final panel, which is a, a nice inclusion. There. Yeah. We're gonna do the next page. Yeah. Elsie! Vush! <laughs> oh, can you zoom in on the Vush? You can see a little. a person just like making a big steppy. Yeah. I pointed it out to Gunny and he was like, oh my god. Yeah, that's Asia coming in. <laughs> yeah. Don't bush! Ezzy! Asia, what's wrong? Nothing. What are you doing all out here, partner? I was here with... I... I, I needed time to think. Ezzy, you left the Wisher all alone, and worst of all is... It's here! Uh, one important fix here was that 
I added Bubble Tales for Asia and the screaming bubble there. And Gunny pointed out. Yeah, because it, it looked it looked like somebody else was yelling off off panel before. Yeah. Especially because Asia was looking to the right. Yeah. Alright, we can do the next one. Use page. use your bubble tails, folks. No tail left behind. Balloon tails, bubble tails, whatever you call them. Get the door to Pizza Hut? What? It's here. Oh, I heard the pizza. <laughs> Asia is a dive kick fighter. <laughs> what? Whoosh. Whoosh. Why won't... Why must I be so alone? All gone. I'll avenge them. Father. The dark matter creature is evolving. It will become stronger as time goes on. Ezzy. The creature will destroy that human's wish, and with it, destroy the wishes of many others. Worse yet, it could start killing mortals on this planet. Mm -hmm. Mostly unchanged. Oh, look, at the look at the wish said little baby. Whatever. <laughs> Next page. I believe you can stop it, Izzy. I understand. I will do what I can. Huh? I didn't tell you that. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to the voice. Voice? What in blazes are you talking about? Can you not hear it? I don't like to make my presence known. But I owe Miracle. And your situation was unfair to begin with. As the world, I don't intend... Uh, sorry, I don't interfere with the actions of others. But there are times where I believe I must step in. Go to Rubelion. He will assist you. I can't fend off the creature forever. Let's follow that thing. See what it's up to. What? Are you going crazy, Ezzy? You can't stop that creature, Ezzy. I will not. We're going to get Rubelion. Ah, silly me. Rubs even used that signal thingamajiggy. Good idea. There used to be dialogue here from the rainbow text. No more. It made no sense. Yay! Yeah, that was a reduction. And you weren't here for it, but when people were asking for advice on writing, reduction was like the one I said, well, I said is the final uh, steps. Yeah. We performed a reduction here. The we, bottom half of that panel is empty because there used to be dialogue there. We added a lot of wine reduction to the comic here. Okay, next one. Uh, let's see where we at. Yes, I'm gonna eat a cracker. Uh, what is all this? Oh, pickles. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I see that bubble, I can't help but laugh. Oh, pickles. <laughs> I'm eating pickle dill crackers right now, too, so... Rubling partner, not again. On set. Over 20 years in the industry, and I've never seen such incompetence in my entire career. I quit. Besides, I don't want to clean this mess. Oh, okay, bye, Saul. <laughs> well, I guess it's the end of the fox den. Yeah, I mean, well, obviously. After the coils ran away, I never expected the show to take such a bizarre twist. Contracts. If that golden fox never attacked me, maybe the producer would have never had the fox den idea. It's still months till the end of contract, but I went out of this mess. Yeah, you can't call Saul anymore. You better not call Saul. Bye, Saul. <laughs> Uh, very much un, uh, unedited. Can you go forward? Yeah, for the most part. My turn. Oh, you brought that here with you. Wanna get cold? It has a name, and it's Kobe. And he's fine with me. Jeez, sorry, Clyde. Didn't think I'd struck a nerve there. No, I'm just too tired. Tired of hunting foxes, tired of this show. It's been out of control since that golden fox. 
Hey, listen. I'm also tired. You know what? Screw this show. Just screw all this. After all that... After all the crap that's gone down? You'd have to be an idiot to stay in this stupid internet show. Are we idiots, brother? No? Exactly. So Kobe, huh? Yeah. Ah, oh, he's cute. I know, right? You think we can bring him to our house? Will the little guy be able to adapt? I don't know, but it's worth a try. Yep. Basically unchanged as well. The only difference is that the bubble tails are now clear. They're self-aware. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they don't- they didn't want to make any more TikToks. We can go forward. Yeah, fixes the comic grammar. That yep. too. So you were telling me that Rublane is ki- Rublane? New Tamberlane crossover with Rubel. <laughs> <laughs> Tamberline. <laughs> oh my god, can you imagine? Can you imagine just, uh, Belfry is fighting a tiny little uh, Among Us astronaut. And be like, this is my Rubeline. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> so you're telling me that Rubeline is capable of this? Y yeah. But how? You're dead, right? You said so. <laughs> Actually, now that I think about it, in them fields, rocks can't benefit from the rain, but they can still get wet. What Azir means is, Ruby, partner. We can interact with those that have no life, like rocks or water. But elements we control? That can even harm mortals. So yes, this fault is mine. Ruby, pal, stop that. And to the point of putting mortals in danger? I screwed up. I say it, stop it. <laughs> I like what Chris said. Chibi Rubelin is just among us. Yeah. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> Next page is yours. Yep. Uh, one moment. I just want to finish this line here. Because it's one of those lines that's like, I've been... I'll get it. There we go. I got it. All right. Next. Uh, let's see. Okay. I failed! <laughs> <laughs> it's not Patrick. SpongeBob, I failed! <laughs> Uh, Rubelai, don't put yourself down. You're a leader and also an elite star warrior. I've thought on it. I am not fit to be leader of our team, Asia. I caused another disaster. I lost track of enemy. I'm no elite star warrior. Well, we ain't just gonna give up now. We need... Yeah, they guide us. Uh, we... I, lost... <laughs> I lost track of Wisher. Well, then we find them in the town again. Hold on. He's not here. What? The wish is changing? His desire to escape this place, I can sense it as his wish. Huh? How do you know that? I, I think I heard it in my head. You hear wish? Well, I, I think so. Can you... Can you hear it? Not at all. If you can hear the wish, then you must lead us. For now, you can be leader. Really? Get to know the Russian access takes post mortem. Yeah, it does. Wow! <laughs> uh, you got the next page. Wait. Uh, you didn't find there, Azzy? Yeah. <laughs> Classic celebratory fist bump. Yeah. Such excitement. Sorry, I wanted to be a leader when I was alive. <laughs> Fox girl, why not put excitement to use and guide us to Wisher? Yes? Oop. Sorry, follow my lead. I'll swear. Funk. Funk. Um. What is this music? What am I? Oh, it's Animal Crossing. It is. Get out of here. So. Uh, important effects here were with Rulain's dialogue in the middle, too. That last bubble said, like, you can't feel human emotions. Ah, oh, you cursed of a 
But it's not the case anymore, and it's better dialogue, actually. It dialogues make sense. Why is Isabel, like, whispering me to my ear? Oh, because the video ended. Okay, I see. Okay. Uh, next page, I read. Oh, it's good that I'm reading this one, I think, because there's a lot of cussing. Right? <laughs> That's true. What do I do? What is this? What the f What the fuck? I attack. We What <laughs> the I can't beat this thing. But I have to. My brother needs me. Please. What the hell is this? <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving Gunny opening his mouth and little keyboard clicks coming out. Yeah, that's Gunny just biting computers. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, are we good? Uh. Oh god, I need to see this thing. Yeah, yeah, so I'm, I'm catching up with a few DMs here, Scott. Okay. Uh, Russet, very clever, very clever, you. Russet DM me, I wish for Scott to tell me all her secrets for the comic. Now, a warrior <laughs> has to come grant my no. wish, right? No. Thank you, BR, for the follow. Um... <laughs> it is my Animal Crossing noise. <laughs> nice. You were close! Uh, we can do the next page. Should be 26. Yep. I'm oh, sorry, 25. No, it's, it's 25. Oh, thank you, mm. Niger Dragon, for the follow. You... <laughs> Just go away. No! I was, I was saying thank you, Niger Dragon, for the follow, and you were like... <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> My bad. Oh yeah, I told Zach some secrets, but he forgot them. Probably. Alright, you can read now, sorry. Hmm. You. <laughs> Just go away. Bang, bang. Fade away. Bam. <laughs> you see? A person is had... dying and you're laughing like a maniac. <laughs> he never had any desires. Well, I can force one. Nope, you misread. Oh, oop. I, mis I misread because I was covered by a gooey on my side. Uh, <laughs> he never had any desires. No major wishes. Well, I can force one. By killing him. So he was talking. He I know, right? Some people didn't realize that the dark matter creature was talking to himself. Like, to himself, basically. Yeah. Yeah, they didn't realize that the Dark Matter creature was talking. But now you do. Now you do. The reason I was laughing was because I went BAM. And then I went BAM here. I immediately thought of BAM BAM from the Flintstones providing bam, sound bam. effects. <laughs> <laughs> Just couldn't stop giggling. And Barney, take care of that BAM BAM already. He's just doing things. Oh my god, he brought a creature. Oh, don't worry, Fred. It's just having fun with the dark matter creatures. Uh, Got the next page. There's still Flimston's multivitamin. Flimston's? The Flintstones, sorry. <laughs> what are the Flimstons? <laughs> Shut up. Shut up, next page. <laughs> It's the Flimstons. Next the page! Flimstons. Next <laughs> page! Next page! I will not. <laughs> He's called Fred Flintstone. His name is not Granddad. With Bernie and Frank. Flimstons. <laughs> End my pain. Ah, this is, a, this, is, this is one of the most edited pages. What a pointless existence you mortals have. Trying to protect others, people live on thinking they. Okay! Trying to protect others, people live on thinking they will live forever. <laughs> when the truth is that they will die. They all die. But when mortals remember this, they go ahead and invent anything to save themselves. <laughs> Shut up! Humanity will always be selfish. What? 
I promised, I promised I wouldn't fail you again, that I would never leave you. I don't care what the hell this thing is. I'm going to stop it. I'm going to do it. Hey, Adam, look, I made a new friend. Oh, no. Kenlis's existence is misspelled. It should not, it should be Wait, ants, not ants. Existence, not existence. Where? Where is this? On uh, the first panel, uh, fourth word on the first line. What up, pointless? This is it existence. This is the beginning. Thank you, Trick. Yep. Let me write that down real quick before we continue. Yeah. <laughs> Get the giggles I'm about to do. Hey, Adam. Do, do, Look, do, do, I do. made a new friend. Do, 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 do. A man is dying remembering his brother, and you're like. I need you to go down. I'm typing one more. Limpstons. Do, 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 do. Okay. I vote that Scott gets to reread this page without me giggling and doing do, do. Yeah. Do, 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 do. What a pointless existence you mortals have. Trying to protect others. People will live on thinking they will live forever. Then, when the truth is that they will. They all die. But when mortals remember this, they go ahead and abandon anything to save themselves. Humanity will always be selfish. What? And then Adam steps in. I promised. I promised I wouldn't fail you again. That I would never leave you. I don't care what the hell this thing is. I'm going to stop it. I'm gonna do it. Hey Adam, look. I made a new friend. Clyde, aren't those dangerous? The koi wolves are the dangerous ones. Not the foxes. Isn't she cute? She approached me whining and anxious. We have to help them. I'm so sorry, Clyde, but she she attacked you. Like a koi wolf. I had to shoot her. You saw her. Why? I thought we were friends. We helped you. Clyde, the projection wants us to hunt the foxes now that the koi wolves are gone. What? But I started all this to help the foxes. I know, but what choice do we have? Dad is sick. Mom was worried. We need the money. We did our best. I don't like it, Adam, but yeah. I'm sorry I failed you. Uh, details for this page. I added more blood. Oh, what? this makes so much sense now. I know, Thank right? you. We, ha we, we really had to work on their story here. Bless Gunny for figuring out a lot of ways to patch in the story I intended to tell previously. Like, oh my god. I understand the backstory now. That's really good to hear, and I'm so happy, actually. Yay. Like, that was the whole thing. I'll find out that it originally was still very baffling. I, I know, it was baffling. It was. No, I'm not going to disagree. It was baffling for me. We spent a week just Scott telling me the whole backstory of just this chapter, and I was like, none of that is conveyed. And now we are <laughs> conveying it. Originally, it was still very bad because they're all dying over Hesse's leg. See? <laughs> this only confirms my fear. What's your theory? I'm curious before you move on. Oh, yeah, that's the also the picture that we saw earlier in chapter two. And that's a game theory. Okay. Next page. Why did I point at someone as if they were here? <laughs> Just that. <immersive. laughs> Speaking of pointing. Ah, uh, shoot. Ah, uh, oh well. I added more blood it's a hard to one Adam. To time. It might be easier if it wasn't the whole Mario walking up. It was just the point. Ah, uh, but the the walking is part of the of the yeah. CDI cinematic experience. That's true. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna pull something. What are you gonna pull? Uh, 
uh, reduce cost points on green screens. Because there's a, there, there's a big cooldown on them anyway. Right? That's true. You choose. S uh, that's your page to read, my friend. <laughs> Such a disgusting sight you are. Slash! <laughs> Izzy was right. Thank the stars. You star chasers. Thought you could run, eh? Now where to go? Ruby, let's fire him up. Whoosh. <laughs> Izzy, stand back. You were unarmed. Wait, 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 wait. What? <laughs> what do I do then? Help the wisher. I love Asia saying, let's fire him up. Someone hated it so much. I'm like, too bad. <laughs> too bad is my comic. Ready for the next one? Uh, yes. And I put a cracker in my mouth. Hi. What am I supposed to do? Get that fella out of here. We are elite warriors. We can hold him back. Uh, okay. Save the killer human, huh? Saving your life while you took mine. This is stupid. But the stars are more important. Let's get you out of here. <laughs> yeah, so. <laughs> I'm just reenacting how it felt, you know? Mm hmm. I'm ready. Same here. 29. Uh, why do I get these pages? <laughs> you don't have to read all of the wishes, to be fair. I'm going to. What the fuck? As you can see, it is oh, no. all connected all along. Everything leads to Gummy. I wish to have my own family one day. Ready? One, two, three, wee. I wish to always have a happy family. I wish to feel the joy of life. I wish to fly like a bird. I wish my brother was something doing okay. I wish mother was proud of me. I wish father was cured. I wish I had a job. I wish to be successful. I wish we weren't so poor. I wish I was an activist. I wish to be as great as my mother. I wish mom gets better. I wish I was more independent. Fourth grade would notice me. So I wish something, something, something in fourth grade would notice me. Huh? Who are these humans? I could easily hear wishes before, but now I can see them. Some of these have been granted, but some are forgotten. I don't feel that these wishes will die, though. Yeah, I had to um, draw the text on all of them, if you can tell. Yeah. That was a fun day. <laughs> I have a crack in my mouth. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Oh my god, a hundred percent. Alright. Before I read the page, because I have a crack in my mouth. How many points should I reduce it to, Gunny? The 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 green screens? I don't know. You're the one that deals with channel points. Uh the green screens are a thousand points as it stands. Okay, it looks like we may have an issue with the crop. Um, because I don't see the bottom of the page. The white the white cutter. Really? Huh. Weird. Yeah, the crop was a little bit too aggressive at the bottom. Scott, stop eating. No, keep eating. Okay, then who do I believe? Yeah, the, there, there is a white gutter. It's just that when I have a full screen application, there's, it's cut off. For whatever reason. Alright, I reduced the price of the green screens in half. This is what's happening. No, that's the mother. <laughs> Poke. I guess the confetti as well, actually. Yeah, it's a laboratory. I'm gonna make it a hundred. Oh, we're gonna have so much confetti. Oh boy. It's important confetti, though. Alright. Next. It should be page 29, I think? Page 30. 31. It's page 30. Okay, mine is incorrect, then. 30, there we go. 
<clears throat> Whoa! Also, I, I, I wanted to fix the effect here on the stars. Connecting. I had the chance to do it. I think it was necessary because before it looked really bad. You remember Gunny, right? Uh-huh. I'm going to help this world just how you helped me, Mom. I wish to give back somehow. Huh? I'm proud of you, son. Who would have known my boy would become such an activist? Is this what you want to do? If this is what you want to do, don't let anyone stop you. I got him just for you, Clyde. I wish me and my new friend have a lot of fun together. Mom, why would our neighbor kill my kitty? I thought he was our friend. <laughs> Son, I'm sorry you found him this way. I, I wish I... But he is in heaven now, don't cry. I wish to end it. End all cruelty in this world. I think Mom forgot this part. Wishes are so much more than our desires. They lead us to follow our dreams, granted or not. Our wishes write the constellations of our lives. As a insider detail, the that cat dying that way is actually inspired by my own, my own childhood, actually. Yeah, unfortunately. Um. Ah, uh, and it, it the worst part. It's not illegal to do that in that country. It sucks. It really sucks. Or rather, okay, not that it's not illegal. It's 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 easy to get away with it. Oh, shoot, but that. Are you sure about that? <laughs> I am sure because oh, no. uh, the neighbor was the next door neighbor too. We called the police, and the police was like, "Well, we don't know where the poison came from. It came from the neighbor. Well, it could have come from you know a a homeless person. It could have just sprayed the front of your of your house." My mom just got so mad, we just moved. It wasn't just one cat either, it was three. It was really bad. Okay, sorry for that weird tangent, but... You know. That's another thing about webcomics, yeah, get inspired by your life in writing. Honestly. No matter what the inspiration is, like, if you think it's gonna strengthen the story in any way, it's beneficial to you is what your experience gives you. You did very well not to get revenge. I was 13. <laughs> How was I going to get revenge? <laughs> Alright, ready for next page? Uh... Yes. Should be 31. It is. Nice. Your turn to read. The stars form who we are. Arg. Like <laughs> pirates. <laughs> Azir? Rubling? Pathetic. These warriors were no match. Don't worry, Emmy. I'll take care of that human for you. You did well to bring those humans here. They followed you to their demise. No, I didn't want this to happen. I always knew you'd make a great leader. None of us did. Thank you. It's all my fault. I just wanted to be a leader because I wanted to show that I was brave. But thinking of my father's wish... Safety is all he wished for. Angry. We all deserve hugs. True. Um, next page should be 30... 32. 32. Yeah. Yes. Don't stand before me like this, Emmy. I'm just trying to do what is best for you. This is how you thank your father? Shut That shut up got improved so much and I love it. You may notice it, but I I hyped the hell out of that shut up, which is very important. I can't scream very well, so I'm just gonna say shut up. <laughs> I am sick and tired of being lied to. Is this how you intend to keep everyone safe? Stay away from us. You dare defend that human after all he did to you and your family? So what? Our lives are guided by our inner desire, our passion, our dreams. This human has a lot of it inside him. But when I look inside you, there is nothing at all. So stop pretending to be my father already. Why he sus? Next page.
<laughs> Double. You know, you were actually right about that. I'm not your father. See, we aren't Star Wars. Yeah, but... we are. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Unlike you, I yearn to be free of these emotions, free to grow and evolve. That is your weakness. <laughs> That is your weakness, <laughs> your unyielding passion for these mortals. To think I was actually scared of you. Such weak beings are easily corrupted. Help me bring about oblivion. That sound effect was really well timed, actually. <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you ready? Yes, next one. Should be 34? Yeah. Mm hmm. This feeling again. again. The anger, fear, ah. evil, darkness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I, see, I see something that needs to be fixed. Oh, really? Okay. Poor yeah. you. If only someone could pull you out of it by force. <laughs> I may not be your father. The taste of blood makes me happy. I need to kill others. But these memories give me that comforting feeling of family. It feels so good to be alive. No you, says Anthrax as he just slides in. That should do it. Can I point out the ice detail? That I always thought was a good? Yeah. So, if, you know, trees are living creatures, right? You need a platform to stand on. Basically, is, is what this is. Very important. No! <laughs> no! I missed the spot! <laughs> God damn it. I can fix it. I can fix it, Felix. Alright, next page. No, don't cancel the comment because of a single hair strand. No, stop pointing it out. What was that? No, that's the shading, actually. The rest is shading. The, the tip on the orange is the problem. Actually. Next page. <laughs> Yanni? Okay. You were close. Oh, I've been muted the whole time because I muted myself for typing. Uh, oh, I see. I, I, I was saying, like, there's also a, lot, a bunch of weird brush strokes that are standing out. Not oh, sure everything to be fixed, sh too. That's shading. Hello, gang. Okay. Oh, am I reading? Yeah, yeah. I am reading. Okay. To defeat three Star Warriors alone, it must have been strong. Huh? <laughs> Tentacle wet sounds. <laughs> Slam. Freeze, pest. Yeah, goodbye. <laughs> Alright. It's weird how I don't even tag the stream as furry, but I still get furry hate. Oh well. Eh, just best to ignore it. Yeah. Next page. We are working today, so... We have no time for memes. Filthy star chitcher... Char... <laughs> Char... <laughs> Char... Star oh god, okay. <laughs> Filthy star chasers, just let me be. <sighs> Dark matter infected her. She has been corrupted. We've lost the star warrior, unfortunate. Uh, we've lost the star warrior, unfortunate. 
Even the cosmic flows abandoned her. My apologies, Fox. Or my apologies, Fox. a questioning Fox. annotation. Yeah, I know. <laughs> ah. It's all good. Alright, I'm ready. Mm -hmm. I'm ready. Next. Push. Push! <laughs> Sorry. Ah. Anthrax, this guy is hurt. There's dark matter on his body. I don't think he's gonna make it. Maybe if I... Do not touch the mortal. Fall back and wait until I'm finished here. But Anthrax, he's dying. I know, but the dark matter will corrupt you too. None can resist it. I've killed. I've lied. I've hated. I am a bad person. It's true. Why does Ezzy have three eyes in that panel? It, it's simulating the same, you know, how many irises does the dark matter have? Many. <laughs> Why is this music same? I, I was doing doo doo and the music was kind of the same. <laughs> Not can resist the Emperor's gaze vibes? Not can resist the Emperor's groove? Uh, you ready for the next page? Yeah, yes. Next page. 38. Ah, perfect music for this page. No, it's not. It's all true. I've been cruel. I never thought about their wishes. How can I be a Star Warrior if I've killed others? Killed their wishes? Then that means I'm evil too. Emmy. Da Dad? Am I, am I reliving a memory right now? What's wrong? I thought you liked to eat chicken. It took us a while to get this one. It would be a sh- <laughs> <laughs> Very nicely timed. <laughs> <laughs> it would be a shame if it went to waste. Alright, Emmy, tell me all about it. What's on your mind? Nicely timed, thank you. <laughs> Yoda's on the gun right now. Uh next page. Should be 39. Yep. Your turn. Well, eating other animals got me thinking. We prey on weaker animals and kill them. How are we any different from the humans killing us? This poor rooster must have had some dreams of his own. It feels bad to take that away from to that. It feels bad to take that away from him this way. Emmy, you're just like your mother. We have a reason, Emmy. We can't survive without eating prey. We must kill because we have no choice. I'm sure every chicken sees us as some really evil creatures, but we would die if we didn't eat. I can't pretend to know their reason, but I'm sure even the cruel, destructive humans have a reason to kill. <laughs> there you go. It pains me to say, but I told this exact same thing to your mother. There is no such thing as evil. <laughs> <laughs> nice confetti at the end. Uh, this page is mostly unedited. Just grammar fixes, honestly. Yeah. I still think that this entire uh, dialogue here is a good representation of how, you know, of different, uh, what do I call it? I, oh god, I, lo I lost my words at the worst Perspectives? Moment. Different perspectives, yeah. There we go. I went forward. Page 40, Thunder. This is, uh, I think this is me? Yeah. Yes. That's right. This darkness can't harm me, or change me. There's a reason for everything we do. But why do these things if we just die anyway? CRASH! BOOM! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Mommy. Emmy? Emmy, my dear. My precious star, what's wrong? Emmy, say something. I'm scared, Mom, I'm so afraid. I'm here, my star, I'm here. Stay close to Mommy. I keep imagining Ezzy's eating barbecue. It's just barbecue sauce. 
Yeah, also, that this image in the middle was significantly different. Yeah, it was uh, a bunch of detached things, but now yeah. it's actually her memory of her mother leaving. Yeah. I remember, like, uh, if you zoom in on the top middle there, of yeah, I had that as an avatar. <laughs> it was so good. <laughs> it's like, oh, this cute little fox was just a bunch of blood on her face. Animals get extremely bloody when they hunt. They're not all posh clean like in, you know, on TV. Scott, yes? Yes, Russet? Yes, Russet? Yes, Russet? Is your words? Bloody cute has a new mini, yeah. It's really nice. Oh. I'm going to hit you with a rolled up <laughs> newspaper later. Why? Well, I didn't do anything! I'm innocent! Well, I no, you've deserved it. Alright, next page? <laughs> ah, no! I'm innocent. Next page, yeah. Don't worry me. <laughs> I think it's my turn. Yes, it is. Tell mommy what's wrong, Miami. Mama Miami! I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, did it. you did it too. I don't. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Tell mommy what's wrong, my Emmy. Mom, I'm scared. I don't. I don't want to die. Don't worry, my dear. Death, of course, is not a very nice thing. But don't worry. It won't happen to you anytime soon. Right now, you should just focus on the fact that I love you so much. But when the time comes, when you're at death's door, try not to be too scared and embrace the darkness. Everything will be fine, I promise. Ah, uh, yes. Finally awake. <laughs> now then, have you seen the truth? We are all bad people deep inside. This, I know now, is fact. This is the worst case scenario. A dark matter star warrior. What were you giggling about? Um, uh, hold on. I need to find my one of my tabs because uh, oh wait, it's wrong thing. Russet presented me with an image just recently. Hold on, let me go. Let me go add it on the. Yes. Yeah, Russet presented me with this. <laughs> up. I can up flip it up. horizontally and just have it. Oops. And now we just. Oops. I try to, to grab the rotation. It's not letting me. Oh my god. Okay, never mind. I can't. I can't Stop rotate it for whatever. Before reason. you break stream. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you ready for your page, Scott? Yeah, one moment. Okay. In a moment, though. Should be 42. It is. Okay. You, f <laughs> you finally <laughs> realize... <laughs> darkness. There's darkness inside me. I can feel it. But that's not all. Who is she talking to? <laughs> and right in the middle of the page, every time... Ah, uh, whoever gets a Mario Poke is a champion. Like, a good one. <laughs> My emotions don't make me weak, they make me who I am. Waking each morning- Wake- <laughs> Wake- <laughs> Okay, waking each morning to the love of my family beneath the warm sun. Feeling nature beneath my feet as I hunt. My heart is filled with memories of my life. Yeah, so this is- For those who were watching this during the Patreon- Page edit stream. My heart is filled of dirt, rock, sand, and many <laughs> yeah. things. I... This this used to confuse a lot of people, and we had to rewrite this on the spot while everybody was watching, and it was such a hard thing to fix. Mm hmm Yeah. It's meant to convey that she has a lot of ex you know a lot of experiences of her life in her in her heart. But I explained it poorly. <laughs> Yeah, for those who don't know, as you hear, he's just list off things you find in nature, like dirt, rocks, snow, sun, etc. My heart is filled with these things. 
it literally sounds like she's saying she has a medical condition where she says debris in her heart. <laughs> that's what that's what the running joke was. Mm -hmm. It was whole the idea that like, and then there are people who confused it, thinking like, "Oh, it's a metaphor of all the <laughs> elements." <laughs> no, it wasn't a metaphor of the elements. Yeah, it's hard because like, especially in this comic where there's elemental powers too. It's yeah, not as easy way to convey. Yeah. All right, next page. Yeah, it's forty-two, or yep. it should be forty-three. Forty-three. It is forty-three. Is there an issue? Oh, it is forty-three. Okay, sorry, I, I was looking at the wrong thing. Okay. <laughs> I always Captain knew. Planet. I always knew, but I had forgotten my heart. I... Who I am today is because of my past, bad or good. It's what I decided to do with that experience that counts. I've had enough of you. None can resist. Lower, lower, lower. The essence of dark matter. I've always had darkness inside my heart. I can feel hatred, regret, fear. I'm going to become better than all this. Any moment now, she will say, by our powers combined, we're Captain Planet. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Planet, he is a hero. Buara would be proud. Yeah. Buara has a friend rock. Forward. <laughs> next, I, I, we can do the next page. Okay. 44. Yeah, it's your turn. No, no, no. No one can reject dark matter. Impossible. You think I'm rejecting it? I can feel the darkness deep inside. I told you to freeze. Annoying. Annoying. <laughs> just a little rat just doing a little ice beam. Yeah. But also it showcases the power that Anthrax holds too. Forward. 45. Minor setback. Your next rat. I must control it. You star chasers will never understand the pain we suffer. I believe in understanding others. But first, Emmy. I'm not going to let something like pain, darkness, or even my own death distract me from what I really care about. Of what's in my heart. Of what's in my past. I care for what others wish for. And if you think you can just kill off this mortal's wish, I will hunt you down. Irritating stick, it's coming for me. Best rat. So this this page also was the foreshadowing of what was to come for the next uh, arc too, of Anthrax is losing control of his power. Yep, specifically this. Yeah. Forward. Page forty-six. Ah, uh, yes. Run to your brother, Adam. You will both perish together. Out of the way. N this page, uh, the tail uh, panel. Giga, during the rewrite streams, pointed to me out that that did not look like a tail coming by, or it was very hard to distinguish it as a tail. So I made a clever art fix there. Yeah, also, Scott, another thing that the, the, why the two eye thing didn't stick. Mm. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I'm specifically referencing the previous pages where uh, the being controlling her was yeah. in, was uh, imposing on her. Yeah, it, the the reason for this too was because like if you add a rule for something, you have to add it forever. Yep. Basically. And this wasn't the case anymore because you know. The purple guy is not around anymore. Ah, uh, we can do the okay, next. Ready? Yeah, yeah. Ha! Stay out! <laughs> Whack! Crack, crack, crack! <laughs> you get the next page. I do get the next page. 
I think I added a little bit on the whack effect to where it looks like. I think you did, yeah. There's like an impact coming, and I think it was a good addition. We can do the next one immediately. Should be 30. Sorry, not 48. Yep, this is 48. Scott? Yeah, yep. Yeah. Sorry, I was updating the, the ah, upcoming gotcha. changes. Crash! Yes. Boosh! <laughs> Sorry. Bang. Yep, Scott has a Kofi. Uh, I do have a Kofi, yeah. If you wish. Animals at the Peter, what they gonna do? We're gonna... We're, we're relaunching my comic. We need to do the whole comic in one sitting in one day. Whee. Yeah. Why would you defend that human after all he did? Don't you realize because he killed you, you don't get to be with your father ever again. I have his memories. I know exactly how he would feel now. Why would you betray him this way? That's oh, the most Jesus. judgmental I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Was well, because like, okay, if you zoom out. If you zoom out. <laughs> <laughs> he's like doing this like tire, like I know his emotions, how he feels. I know you betrayed the blah, 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 you know, all the negative yeah. uh, emotions from her father. Meanwhile. Can you shut up already? Yeah. Pat <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> pat. You can do the next page now. Is it confirmed to me? Uh, this is 50, right? This is 49. Okay. Your turn to read. Yep. Just repositioning my butt in my chair. In context, it's judgmental on its own. It does look like I, I am not impressed. I am annoyed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Emmy, didn't you listen to me? No, not Emmy. Not anymore. You see, truth is, nothing lasts forever. <gasps> Blaze Spikes, Blazy of Spikes just donated 25. First. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Blaze. Welcome to my Ko-Fi. Not Emmy more. Oh, <laughs> that's really good. That's a that's really good, good pun, Mitchin. The game was also rigged from the start. Oh. You do the next page. 50. If you see my, by the way, my hand going over the tablet, by the way, is because I'm drawing the commission right now or the work I have to do. Yeah, Scott's trying to multitask a little bit. Emmy has come to an end, as all things do. My name is... Among no, Esmeralda. No. No, no, no. Why forgive that human? Why? Humans have been very cruel, but in my eyes, they were also interesting to me. That human and me, you and I, we are not so different. I don't like how small her hand is. She has a baby hand in the last panel. <laughs> but I am not fixing it because I'm not doing art fixes specifically unless it's story relevant. Or it's like really easy to fix. Which is yeah. Not. Arthur head? No, 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 no. The Arthur head is coming. Not yet. We can okay. do the Ready? next one, yeah. Person. Pantry. Yeah. Person looking. Recording a video. Even if I hated them, I found humans interesting. Just give up. I'm sure father's memories are telling you how strong their magical thunder collars are. If you're mad enough to join your murderers, fine. I hope this is how you use it. Oh, poor Ezzy. Ezzy Gunfresh. <laughs> you do the next one. I don't need you. I am fine alone. I don't care if you stand in my way anymore. If you want to dialogue with those humans, fine. So be it. Bush! <laughs> <laughs> I just like how the eyes too are like 
doing like a little squinty in the top right of that panel. They're like, what the hell is this? <laughs> <laughs> it's not the humans I'm standing for. It's wishing. It's hope. It's the stars. Zert. It's more like a, you know, as you get your gun. Yeah, next page. And there's no dialogue here. Whatsoever. There's no dialogue. It's just a bunch of sound effects. Yeah. Is he shooting her cannon? Huh? <laughs> there, that's my page done. No, no, you're getting the next one. <laughs> you're not getting away with this one. Next page. What is this thing? All I wanted was to feel alive. She promised I would. A strong desire from within you grew the more we fought. You don't even realize that you have it. You should already know, though, that I care about all wishes. You can do the next page. I'll do the next page. But yeah, she... It used to be Omega ambiguous, so... Yeah. Next page. Even though I attacked you, I just couldn't bear to see you die again. I couldn't do it. I give up. I have not given up on you. Your wish is to feel alive like my father. Come now. Hug me. Why? Because we can all make wishes. All of our wishes are important, Dad. But I'm not your real father. These are just memories. They are yours too. Your feelings are telling you that I'm your enemy, right? Follow your heart. I'm his anguish, his pain, of your loss, nothing more. Shut up about that. What is your heart saying? Emmy. Sorry, uh, this, this, this page makes me sad. Emmy! Do not say Emmy. <laughs> Emmy. <laughs> uh, next page. Best. You can do the next page. Yep. Uh, yeah. If you zoom on the top right, really quickly, actually, it was not very clear that Anthrax was attacking, but there he is. This page is so devastating. Yep. That's the point. That was too close for comfort. I have no clue how your distraction worked. You resisted the corruption somehow. Well done, but don't be so reckless next time. Dark matter creatures are relentless, and they will stop at nothing to corrupt you. You just got lucky. He wasn't. He was actually all right. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be a brat. What would have happened if Anthrax didn't intervene? Hmm, that's a good question. A very good question. Um, let's see, next page is 56. Yep, you can do the next one. Or you can pass the next page. Ah! <laughs> Let me drink something. <laughs> oh my god. Also, tick the counter to 57. I didn't? Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Don't let your kids watch it. That's how my trial came to an end. I knew that the creature destroyed before my eyes wasn't really my father, but he did look like him, and I, he called out my name in earnest. And made me want to go out and see my real father, but that rat wouldn't let me. We si he said we had to leave. We must see the council at once. You are nearly corrupted, he said. Even Rubeline agreed that I should be allowed to see my father and uncle. He was lectured as they walked, as, as they walked me towards their rally point. His pupil, another human, was waiting with the other Star Warriors, working around the area. We were to leave on this ship. I had no idea what this even was back then. But still, I was glad on that night. I made wishes come true. I became the hope I always sought. 
Besides, I could always come back later. Now I had all the time in the world. What do you mean I can't return <laughs> immediately after? <laughs> you failed your trial by ignoring the wish. You must now face the council. Back at Polaris. The wish granted itself. Go check. Granted itself, sure kid. Uh, it's jolly, everyone. Yeah, now I could check for you. For you. I'd rather not be lazy and go check on the little rebel's claims. I'll go myself. <sighs> sure, Jolly, go. But I swear, if this is another one of your pranks, just leave it to my detective prowess. Please, don't call it that. Yeah, so yep. for those that don't first know... First cameos. Yeah, this is the first cameo of the comic here. Jolly. Uh, they're my friend Gigabyte. Giga is very good at figuring out my nonsense hidden information things yeah that's the giga that scott's been referring to if you've been watching this video for the past five and a half hours oh my god <laughs> oh five hours according to my ticker okay five hours all right next <clears throat> All right, go sit down and await for takeoff. Oh, um, when can I come back here? Not until a while, just go and sit. Wee, wee, wee. <laughs> oh, thank you for the follow. Thank you, Basil Brush. How much is a while? How many winters must I wait? If I come back when it's too late, will my home still be here? I'm just worried that I may not see my fa- It doesn't matter at the moment. We'll discuss this later. Just pick a seat and sit down. All right, I'm going. Yo, don't worry, he's always like that. You mean, he's always angry? Nah, he's always <laughs> He's just looking out for us. <laughs> A lot of people forget why she's asking so many que stupid questions like that. Remember, Esmeralda is only about 10 months old. She's a child. Yep. Although that information hasn't been revealed yet in the comic, that's not until like chapter yeah. six. But you see that uh, she's just a kid. Yeah. Uh, Captain Esmeralda, however, is more than 20 years old at that point. I Big didn't say speed. it, Izzy. I used the button. Yeah. Stop, shut up. Yeah. Next page. One second. Say, figure something out. I can't believe Gunny Custis <laughs> shakes my head. Hi, Caps. <laughs> hey, a question. Do you care about wishes? Uh, huh? Sure, of course I do. Wait, why did I say sure? That's not in the dialogue. Huh? Of course I do. There we go. Why didn't you just... Why didn't you grant the hunter's wish? It just vanished now. That one wasn't meant to be granted. Um, okay, can you explain this shit to me? Because you're... Getting trouble with the arcanes. Well, I mean, I don't claim to know it all. He did wish to impress his friends at the, uh, place. To convince everyone to stop, but it didn't work. That creature stopped everyone, not him. Then he just wanted to leave. Boosh! I can't really understand what was happening in his mind at that time. But I knew one thing. Those wishes he made were because he was afraid they were not that important. Wait, what? Those wishes he made were because we're, he, we're was because he was afraid. They are were they not were that not. important. I didn't see, there you go. <laughs> there were no, I didn't see the period. I thought the human's wish was petty. But then I felt his true wish. The one that was guided sorry, the one that has guided him for his entire life. The wish he holds in his heart. He wished to end the mindless cruelty towards animals. Also, uh in this page, yeah. Uh, <laughs> his face was really bad for the reveal. Don't look at the little thing. It's fine. He was like half lit like, what is this? You know? <laughs> ah, not his eye! <laughs> also, yeah. we, we just did a lot of dialogue on this page just to make it more clear. Yeah. Easier to read. Way easier to read. Next page. 60. You read this one. We don't really know what we wish for. 
But at one point, we get to what we really want. How about you? Did you make a wish come true? Or did you let the wisher find his true desire? Either way, Fox, you still need to face the council of arcane warriors. Because that is not how wishes are granted. Like, at all. Chill, I'm just saying how it is. Because I actually <laughs> agree with you, you know? <laughs> but orders are orders. Yo, check it out. Do we have any spare stardust? Do I need to fix my cape? Maybe it'll cheer you up, girl. Uh, what is this? <laughs> and this is how it began for me. My ascension as a cosmic being. A star warrior. Of course, I didn't become captain immediately. Back then, I didn't have much control over my weapon or my powers at all. I did have one of the most important skills of them all. I understood why people make wishes. Thank you, Azur. <laughs> so, two special things about this page. One, in case y'all didn't know, this is a photo Scott actually took. Yeah. It was... So, Scott actually owns the property of this photo. I do. I can use it. The other thing is, Anthrax saying, do we have any spare starters? I need to fix my cape. Thank you, Azur. Those were added to deal with the fact that Anthrax has holes in his cape, and then they suddenly vanish later. Yeah. <laughs> That's the entire reason that dialogue is there. But it ties it all together, so it's nice. <laughs> it ties everything together. Plus, it teaches y'all that Stardust can be used to repair things. Yeah, and also, this page shows you that all you need to do to make someone understand people is to show them memes. <laughs> also, that meme doesn't exist, so... Also... I thought it was a clever way to add a meme that doesn't exist so that it's not, it doesn't die to time, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, that makes perfect sense. It won't die to the passage of time, it will only die to the passage of culture, I guess. I don't know. Is there another page? Yes, there is another page. Let me know when to go to it. Yep, yeah, go to it. Some wish to make their dreams real, for they have felt much misery. Some seek revenge with murder in their intents, for they have been betrayed. Some wish to be with their loved ones eternally, for they have lost everything else. And some wish for their hearts, to find a reason to exist. I am a star warrior, your wish will come true. Goodbye uncle, bye bye forest, and love you father. I must move on. Got some questions in chat. Does that include physical damage, broken limbs, etc.? Well, it depends on if Stardust applies to you. I would love to see a mortal survive a transfusion of pure Stardust. You know, just pumping cosmic dust into their bloodstream. Oh, God. They die. Um, <laughs> uh, so it, it really depends on the item in, in question. Um, it's kind of like asking if wood glue works for plastic. It don't. Russet, in 8,000 years, when some aliens find your comic and think this was our belief system, that would be cool. <laughs> yes, it's about... Can Stardust... Go on. Go on. No, you go on. Can Stardust be molten and made to a high-grade metal Star Warriors can use? I... don't know. The reason why I say I don't know is because to say that would mean the Stardust is only a metallic composition when yeah. really... it can be any form of an element stardust is more of an umbrella term for the fine misty material that a uh, cosmic body uh, emitter leaves behind you consider it like so, matter i guess matter for cosmic beings general matter yeah because in real life stardust is there's no one kind of substance it's made up of it's not a, it's not a defined composition is what i'm trying to get at yeah i took it that Star Warrior bodies are made of Stardust. I mean, yeah. Yeah. They aren't sand people, but Stardust is... They're not is, sand people. <laughs> it's kind of like how we're made up of elements, but we're not made of carbon, but yeah. we're a carbon-based life form. They're like monsters from Undertale. Oh, no. <laughs> But yeah, there could be Stardust, that, which its composition does consist mainly of metals. That could be melted down, because it consists mainly of metals. 
it just depends on the stardust where it came from, what its composition is. So it's, that's really more of a question of does metal exist in this universe? Yes. Yes, it does. That's, that's the best way to answer it. Hey, next page. Guess what page you get, Gunny? Oh, God. I'm... <laughs> I can get the big one, don't I? Yep. Okay, let's split this up, actually. I'll be Cosmos, you be Miracle. Okay. But I'm not putting this music. Yeah. No. Your daughter- Okay, by the way, this is a big edit on this last page, because it has so much- It's- this whole page was replaced. Yeah. We wanted to show... better we'll get, things we'll, in the story. We'll get to it when- after we do it. Yeah. Your daughter is safe. She's on her way to Polaris now. Oh, thank the stars, and thank you. I don't do favors often, so tell me, what is going on here? You know more than you should, more than enough. I'm worried about you. You've changed, behaving like a criminal ever since you stole from us. I am still the same, despite everything. Trust me, I only mean to do well. You would do well to return what you took. I can never do that. None could. As he's stubborn, just like you. I'll take that as a compliment. I could not be more proud of her. She managed well, despite your involvement. I apologize for complicating things, but it has been handled. What have you done with him? I could not help him. Regina will do her best, though. The Zodiac must endure. And End of Esmeralda's ascension. ascension. <laughs> That's the end of chapter three. There was a lot here that uh, originally it was like this fluff, 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 you know? Yeah, that was just all fluff. It didn't get into the actual story beats. And we can't detail what hero story beats and what is not. So we're going to leave you to interpret this how you wish. Mm -hmm. Have fun. Woo! <laughs> Also, this marks the half point, so it's been 5 and 60, of hours and 16 minutes. Well, we still gotta do the interlude. Well, yeah, but it's still the half point because chapter 6 is not completed. Oh yeah, I suppose so. So I think the stream was gonna take 10 hours after all. We were not off on that mark. Yeah. Well, let's do the interlude. Okay. Before all this happened, before Emmy died, before I met you, before you died, we were all scared of koi wolves. We hunt for food, for survival. They didn't. They were territorial, attacking without reason at times. I'll never understand them. Beware of the mightiest ones, I was told. Get too close to their ever-expanding territory and they would strike. No one was safe, the old, sick, even our kits. Thankfully... Their terror came to a swift end when I set eyes on you, Eister. Interlude, the meeting. You were just a new fox that came out of nowhere, sitting out in the open. As this was Koi Wolf territory, I was scared you may end up hurt, or worse, taken away by the Koi Wolves. Where did this beautiful female come from? Fox thoughts, by the way. Yeah, so... <laughs> Uh, I still say it's going to take 11 to 12 hours. Yeah. It may because we're coming up to some major um, story things coming up to. Mm hmm. Uh, we can do the next one. Hold on. <laughs> she is sitting on a thing outside of place. Correct. Mm hmm. We actually changed a lot of dialogue on each of these uh, interlude pages. Yeah. Finally, my new home. Life is harder than we thought it to be, yet peaceful. That was the first thing I heard you say back at your favorite place. At first, I didn't think much of it, but I had no idea just how different you really were. Who's there? Come on, don't be shy. I know there are more foxes here. I want to meet you. How? How did she know I was here? I'm the best among foxes when it comes to hiding. Come out now, I won't hurt you. 
golden female, you are the most beautiful vixen I have ever seen. Please <laughs> let me be your mate and protect you from the vicious koi wolves. That was fast. Thanks, I guess. <clears throat> Let's take a little stroll first. This is a nice forest. I want to check it out. What's your name? Name? What is that? Seriously, you don't have a name? I liked you. The things you did for us were incredible. You taught us how to work together like the Koi Wolves. By your guidance, I became our first alpha male. I swear to protect you from then on as your mate. Finding you that day, your golden fur radiating in the sunlight. That was a blessed day. I love you dearly. This part of the interlude was changed quite a bit. For reasons we cannot explain yet again. Yeah. Do the next one? Yeah. Just distract about my phone for a moment. Oh, okay. Even when you were pregnant, you performed miracles. Our child needs their protection. I thought you a fool for approaching the humans. You surprised us all by befriending them, all for our child, our Emmy Eister. The day before you died, you knew something. Aries, I'm going to die. I'm sorry. Please take care of our dear Emmy. Was that something you did to protect us all? Did you know the humans were going to turn on us? Did you protect us? I never knew. Even when you returned, I knew nothing. Deal. Just know this. Your dark desires for revenge won't fulfill you. Your soul yearns for family, not revenge. Don't lose that. I knew you would feel this way after what I did. Understand that. Understand what? That I can never see her again? Never live with her? Emmy isn't gone forever. She's working hard to protect what's important to her. What's important to all of us, Emmy. Forgive them. The same way we seek forgiveness from our prey. You taught me that, remember? How? How, when the two I love most were taken from me. I love you both. Hold your heart, my dear. Just how you held mine when I met you. You are the sweetest person I've ever been with. Take care, Ares. <clears throat> Eister. Take care of her if you can, please. Surely I will see you one day. I love you both. And that truly is the end of chapter three. Yep. That's the end of the chapter. And we're in chapter four. I have to close all these. Mm hmm Hopefully this, this interlude makes a lot more sense to people now. Honestly, yeah. I'm gonna dip this was amazing to watch. Yeah. If you have to dip, right. no worries. Take There's care, going Curus. to be a VOD. Yeah. Take care, Curus. Hope you have a blessed, blessed day. <laughs> Why is there wind in my room? A lot more sense. Okay, that's good to hear, actually. Ah, let me just stretch my legs a bit. Uh, reconvene in like a couple minutes. I think. Yep. Okie dokie. Um, before I close this page. Yeah. Deal. Yeah, that was never revealed until now. That was never revealed that in the previous page where uh, this character is asking for Ares to make a deal, this is the second half of that conversation at the tree. This was the best we could do to make that as clear as possible. Alright, we can in a few minutes. I'm gonna get something. Yeah. Fantastic. I'm glad that that is what helped. Yep, everybody's favorite scenes. I'm gonna take a short break here. I'm just gonna read chat. I'll happily answer questions if y'all have any questions. I'm just gonna relax otherwise.
What rite of passage? You haven't read this far? Oh, this will be fun then. Oh, that rite of passage. Oh, and for those, don't spoil what's coming, because there are people here. It's their first time seeing these pages. Oh, it's fine. Did I ever do anything overseas? As I'm almost sure I originally saw Star Wars stuff at a UK comic. No. I don't think Scott has ever gone overseas with uh, her comic. I'm fairly confident. Yes, chapter 4, page 1 is indeed next. Issues that overseas conventions are pretty expensive when you factor in multiple people traveling for it. Like, it's a hard sell to go to an overseas convention. Most people who do that are already pretty well off. Like, if you're we invited as a guest. Or if there was a good financial reason, probably would. That's just my own personal take, though. Because as fun as conventions are, you really have to view it as a business investment. Like, no joke, we crunched incredibly hard for like three months just to get this uh, relaunch done before Frontal Equinox. Because it's so bad to go to a convention and say, hey, don't read my webcomic. It's about to be relaunched. But after this unknown date, please read it. Yeah, that, wouldn't have, that would not have helped. Yep. Conventions be expensive, especially for a creator going overseas. It takes it costs so much more money to bring everything you're selling with you, especially if you're selling books, which Scott is trying to sell. Imagine transporting a literal brick of paper all the way to the UK. Like a giant container of just books. So expensive. It's not even with the guarantee that they'll sell. Hey, Izzy, you fly over the pond uh, semi-frequently as of late. <laughs> you wanna... Smuggle some comic books with you. Oh yeah, America's so much easier. Because it's land transport, there's no flying. 